Hello, this is Nick Dancer with Nick Dancer Concrete, and today we're in Huntington, Indiana, in about a thousand square foot basement. Uh, when we got started on this project Monday, the floor was covered with an adhesive residue from the tile that was previously on the floor. So Monday we shot blasted the floor, which removed all the, the glue. Um, we removed the top layer of concrete surface so we could get down to good, solid, sound concrete. Yesterday we spent the day uh, applying a thin overlay to the whole floor. Uh, we did two coats of the overlay and this is going to be the base color for our stain. This also sets the profile for the finished floor. Uh, the finish we have on the floor right now is similar to a smooth trout concrete floor that you get. Uh, the floor is looking brand new right now. We're going to get started staining and sealing today, hopefully finish up the project. Uh, so I'm going to take you on a little tour of this floor so you can see what uh, it looks like after we apply the overlay. So as you can see, the floor has a nice smooth finish to it. Much different from when uh, we started the project. There were some cracks in the floor that we repaired yesterday also to make sure we have a nice seamless floor. And the overlay uh, color for this project was gray. We also have an overlay available in white. Um, either way, those overlays can be stained or we left like this. This one is actually getting a Cordovan leather stain. Uh, we're going to apply that at about an 80% coverage, which is going to let some of this natural gray concrete color show through and um, mix with the Cordovan color, which will go good with these uh, nice wood walls we have in here.